Hi, my name is Brenda Hollingsworth. I'm one of the owners of OJ Hollingsworth Personal Injury Lawyers. Today I want to tell you about five things you should do after an accident where you are not at fault. First and foremost, you want to make sure that everybody is in safety. So make sure that you are not in the middle of the road uh, and help anybody else who needs medical assistance. Medical assistance is the number one priority when there is a, an, an accident. The second thing you want to do is make sure the police are called. Now in busy cities in Ontario, sometimes the police service will tell you that they can't come to the accident scene. But the fact is, if there's more than $2,000 worth of damage to the vehicles, which most of the time there is because it, that doesn't take very much, or anyone feels any injury at all, the police are required to come. So if you have a headache or a sore neck or you feel like you hit your knee, make sure that the police come. Tell them that there are injuries and they will come. And uh, you may not feel this full severity of your injury at the scene, but if you're feeling something, there is a very good chance that there's going to be an injury that emerges. The third thing that you should do at the scene of an accident is secure any witnesses that may have seen the accident. Witnesses are really important later on when it comes time to prove who was at fault for the accident. So if there is a bystander, somebody who came to your aid, get them to put their name in your phone or get them to text you. If you don't have a phone, uh, maybe you have a piece of paper and a pen, or maybe they have a business card, but do your best to get that person's name so that later on you have their support when you go to describe what happened in the accident. The fourth thing that you should do at the scene of an accident is take photos. Ideally, you'll take photos before the vehicles are moved. You want to be able to show where the vehicles came to rest so that you can help show how the accident happened. You should also take uh, pictures of the damage to the vehicles, uh, your vehicle and the other vehicle. Uh, if there are skid marks on the road, try and get pictures of that or any debris on the road. I also suggest taking pictures of the other vehicle's license plate and uh, the um, insurance information of the at-fault driver. Finally, our recommendation is at the scene of the accident, you avoid that very, very Canadian thing of saying you're sorry. You may well be very sorry that an accident happened and it may be a natural instinct for you to want to apologize. You can be empathetic and sympathetic and helpful without taking responsibility for the accident at the scene. So those are five things that OJ Hollingsworth recommends that people like you do at the scene of an accident. I hope you don't get into one, but if you do, there's our advice. Thank you very much.